I can guarantee that you've never seen an Easter egg attempt quite like this because in our last video, our top comment was from the Stray Warrior saying that we can do whatever we want, but after every round, we have to pray to Garfield. And if you're anything like me, you're thinking, what does this even mean? But don't worry, I'm going to get into it, but buckle up because it's going to get weird. But since they said we can do anything, I'm going to go ahead and get our AMP 63s done. And I'm going to go ahead and upgrade our assault rifles all the way to tier five because something's got to get upgraded here. But before we get into what's bound to be my weirdest video ever, if you want to leave any weapons, weapon upgrade or challenge suggestions go ahead and leave it in a comment down below i'll have a comment there as well with everything that we've already completed so make sure you check that out first that way we don't get any repeats all right so first of all i mentioned that we're doing an easter egg so i'll be getting the d machina easter egg done today and then we'll only have one easter egg left for our super easter egg that being forsaken but with this whole praying to garfield thing i was really confused when they first mentioned this like when i went and i read that comment i had no idea what they meant and i was debating on like replying to it and asking you know what the hell do you want me to do here but i feel like that takes a lot of the creative freedom out of it and i feel like every round is a bit much so i'm gonna do every five rounds i feel like that's a good compromise so just for our first one love you garfield and what day did it say when we got in here that d machina takes place on it was like november 13th something like that 1983 all i'm saying is it better not have been a monday because i hate mondays but what i don't hate is lasagna and getting camos and camo progress towards dark aether because i'm pretty sure once we get these amps done we'll have a uh, plague diamond on our pistol so that'll be another class done we've been kind of lollygagging on our dark aether progress because we've just been doing a lot of the same weapons out of the same class so i figured if i'm picking we're actually gonna make some progress here you know a few steps forward towards dark aether but like why Garfield? This is a real question. So I feel like Garfield hasn't really been around too much in pop culture recently. Like, obviously, it's like a big figure and everybody knows like Garfield. But this just seems so odd and so random. But you know what? As long as I'm picking what we're doing here, I'll take it. Oh, round five. Gotta pray. Um, hail Garfield, full of lasagna. May your orange light shine upon us. I don't fucking know. All right, I think we got enough money to go turn on power. So I just pray that Garfield watches over us and protects us on our way there. All right, power is now on. We just got to turn on these terminals. But well, this got me thinking. If Garfield's really out there, I want a sign, you know? Garfield, if you're there, let me know that you're, you're watching over me. I feel like I could get a lot closer to our boy Garfield if, you know, he just let me know that he's there, that he's around. So if you're hearing this Garfield, give me a sign. I mean, so far he's protecting me. We got all the way to repair Pack-a-Punch without getting killed. He's got to be watching over somewhere. What? Hold on, I'm going to go get that. Oh, shit. Look at this. This just showed up at my door. He's got to be real. He's actually watching over us. That's much better. Look at this. Now that we got Garfield over our hearts, there's no way we can lose. Quick little ring of fire supplied by our Lord Garfield. Megaton's already split. Zombies dying left and right we cannot be stopped this is so weird dude i feel like i'm making like a sonic.exe video let's see if we can get a little offering from garfield here you gotta hit our lasagna orbs oh i think it's working oh would you look at that they're bringing in a casket that's got john in there or maybe even Odie. fuck them they're ops oh and we're on round 10 you know what my prayer to garfield is i just want to be more like him Oh, I'm an idiot. I just bought Jug before getting the free Jug seconds later. I should have been thinking about Garfield. Actually, you know what? That's what I get. I, it's round 10 and I didn't pray to him. You know what? I just want to be more like Garfield. If I was more like him, all these issues here would not be happening. So Garfield, you've answered my prayers before. Please just make me more like you. Wait, hold on. I'm I'm kind of feeling something here. I feel like it's it, it's happening. It's something. Something's changing. Okay, I see what the problem is here. I think I was talking to the wrong Garfield. I must have been talking to Andrew Garfield. My spidey senses were a little off there. All right, well, Garfield, you know, you had your fun. You had your jokes. I want to be more like Garfield the cat. I'll be very specific this time. I want to be just like Garfield the cat. Oh, shit. I'm getting that feeling again. I think it's happening. Ah! I hate Mondays. Anybody else starting to feel like all of a sudden they hate Mondays? This is so stupid. I don't think I should have gotten the inflatable costume. I can't even sit in my chair while I play. I'm kneeling on the ground right now. But we're going to get this fucking Easter egg done. I tell you what. I asked to be more like Garfield and this is what I get. But we got to get our little remote for the DIE. Give me that. Let me show you guys what it looks like if I sit down real quick. Oh. Holy shit. 
This is so stupid. I cannot see. My eyeballs are too high up. Can you see me through the eye holes? This might be the dumbest fucking thing I've ever done in my life. All right, well, back to business. Come on in here. Let's start up our DIE. I can't believe I can actually do this in the suit. Oh, is that not even enough? Oh, we need more zombies. All right, hopefully this is enough zombies this time around. It should be. There's no reason why it shouldn't. Perfect. Give me that. There's like one bead of sweat that just went down my entire back into my ass crack. I'm like in one of those suits that people use to like lose weight, like those garbage suits, like what boxers and like wrestlers use to make weight. That's what it feels like. But I'm going to try to get some Easter egg steps done right here. We'll shoot that down. We'll come over here and grab this. There we go. And now that that's down, we can pick that up. Gimme. We can head into the dark aether real quick. And while we're here, we can break this open. Grab our fuse and we can start looking for our aether scope parts. There's one right there. And since we got hellhounds or plague hounds, let's try to lead them down. Oh, I probably should have looked for the aether scope part by the, the plane. Well, that's all right. We got another one right here and we can go right into here, place down the tank. And hopefully this is good enough for it. And I don't get myself killed. I'm very good at getting myself killed in this spot. And all that plague hound gas ended the round, but I think we got it filled. Sweet, we did. Let's see if our last aether scope part is over here before we get kicked out of the aether. Oh, it is. Give me that. And we got a megaton spawning. Everything's falling into place. Speaking of place, we placed our little tank on top of the... What is it? The toxic gas one? And now we have that ammo type. And now we have a megaton here. I just need you to shoot this tree for me, buddy. Beautiful. Look at you. I'm dominating these Easter egg steps right now. Garfield is the move. All right, let me get this round down a bit here. Get this megaton out of here. Go ahead and fuck off, megaton. Bastard. And the round's pretty low here. So we can grab our cryo freeze. Let's craft our aether scope real quick. There we go. Now we can do all these doctor whatever steps. We need his little diary. And there you go. We got Greg Heffley's force ghost telling us a story. And while he's doing that, we'll just go up to all the other ones so this dude can get done with all of his talking. I have my face pressed right up against these eye holes. All right, where's that motherfucker? There he is. All right, tell us your final story. Anyone else suddenly craving lasagna? I know I am. But now that that's over with, we can go back up here and put in the dumbass's password. And now we got to go around and get all these ammo mods. Now, I'm no scientist, but it seems like it could be used to restore brain function and uh, the undead specimens. How do you know that, Carver? How does just looking at a machine in a lab make you think that that will revive brain activity in a zombie? What the fuck do you know? All these Easter eggs are just made by like huge leaps in like thought like hold on wait a minute maybe this could actually help us out here in this very specific way but we do need to start putting our ammo mods on this where's the blue one i think it's this does that not work do i not do the ammo mods yet or am i doing the wrong one i think i'm doing the wrong one. Oh wait no it went up okay cool i've done these easter eggs so many times but i always forget the steps now we can grab the stinky ammo mod and now we just gotta shoot it into this Beautiful. We just got two more to go. Now, which one do we get if we go through this portal? Oh, it actually might be this one. Yeah, the box is gone. I don't see any of the crystals, so that is the one we gotta do. And that's right down here. Activate the fuse. Start cutting that bitch open. And we should be able to grab it now. Give me that. And that goes right here. Perfect. Now we just need one more. And we can get that by going through this portal. We need to get the three glowing crystals. There's gonna be one up here in penthouse. And our round just ended. Perfect. Beautiful. Exactly what I want to see while doing an Easter egg step. But we can still get it done. We're crazy. And now that we have this glowing shot, we gotta put it into this. And now we just got two more of those to grab. Oh no! Why are you in the staircase? You're fucking this whole thing up, buddy. Oh, no. If I'm going down, you're going down with me, motherfuckers. Why did that nade go off? All right, whatever. Cool. We'll take it down. Don't matter to me. I got Garfield on my side. Let's try to at least grab one more crystal. We'll head on down. And before it sends us back, let's launch this bad boy in. Cool. And now we got to fight for our fucking lives. I'm so scared right now. I do not want to restart. And oh, actually, I do have enough to get a self-revive. Let me try to sneak that in. There we go. I should probably get quick revive, though. 
That might help out. Give me that. And we'll get Jug back. Our portal has returned, so I'm going back in. Where's our last crystal? Where is it? It's supposed to be right here. Oh, wait, no. We already grabbed that one. We need this one. Give me that. I hope I can still shoot it, even though I only have 15 bullets or 15 ammo, have 15 essence, whatever the fuck that means. Let's hope it works. Ah, oh, it did. Sweet. I will be taking the Electro Bolt, and let's go ahead and put it onto that. So now we have all of our ammo mods. We just need to get a Megaton to split and go in there. Now, I'm not going to lie. I don't remember what to do next. Actually, yes, I do. Let's head through this. And I think we need to figure out how to power it. Yeah, this is open. Let's do this. Watch the workers go. Oh, yeah. We need to find the, the golden nipple and put it in there. Stolen. Um, Where's the wrench? There it is. Quick little Aether wrench. Now we need to use this wrench to fix up the tank. I think that's all fixed. The top hatch is now open and we got a zombie who needs to be naded. Is that going to do it for us? Maybe another one? Oh, great. Plague Hound, he jumped right in front of that one. Oh, wait, the tank just went off. Let's go. Oh, round 15. Uh, shot to my boy, big orange in the sky. Hold on. That one's for you, buddy. He has kind of been watching over us here. We only have one down, and that was just to keep us in check. But before we can do our next step, I need to get this round down a bit. There'd be way too many zombies in the way. And I accidentally had a nuke. I'm a fucking genius. Whatever. We'll have to wait another round. We got camos to get anyways, in case you forgot. All right, this should be enough. I think we're good right here. I think we just unlocked the camo, but I have no idea. I can't read. Not like I could anyways, but this suit don't help. But after that tank shot... There should be something over here for us to pick up. Oh, there it is. So I will be grabbing that. And we just need to bring this back all the way to med bay and toss that in. Now we need a megaton. Oh, we got a megaton. Let's go, dude. Let's get you splitting. There we go. And let's try to lead them back down to med bay. Oh, there's our 750 crits. I saw that one. We still need like 1,250 more. No, more than that. 1,750. Ridiculous fucking number. I don't think I have any right to be calling anything ridiculous right now. Oh, here they come. All right, come on, guys. Let's go over here. Just walk right under that. That's all I need you to do. Come on, they're both right outside of the circle. Just get over here. Oh, wait, do I need to hit the button or something? What am I missing here? Walk under it. All right. How am I fucking this up? I'm looking up a tutorial. Hi, guys. Mr. Ruffles here. This is your no-nonsense guide to do the D-Machine Easter egg. I'm confused, because I've done everything up until this point right. Why aren't you guys going in? Maybe they're both in the circle, that's why it didn't work? So why don't you guys try taking turns going through it? Come on. Oh, there we go. Oh, perfect. So they just weren't right underneath it or some shit. Well, go ahead and combine back. Beautiful. It's kind of crazy how this guy died, came back as a zombie, then was reanimated again back into a person. I've almost gone through as many transformations as him today. But watch his goofy ass run as he gets out of here. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Well, that's not good. They just ambushed me the second that ended. But I'm pretty sure the next step or two here is going to start like the final part of the Easter egg. And I kind of need to get these Plague Diamond before then. So I'm going to start working on grinding out my camos. Now we'll see how good my camo grinding abilities are in a big fucking cat suit. Oh, there's our bloodshed camo. Still need a thousand more normal kills. Oh shit, it's round 20. Um, all, all hail Garfield, our savior above. Our orange round and lasagna filled god. The best part about these guns though is once you get it synced up right, you don't ever have to stop shooting. Even while you were loading one, as long as you still got bullets in the other, it's just constant gunfire, which is really bad for our ammo count because I just keep running out of it. Oh shit, round 25. Hail Garfield, full of lasagna. Thy cat is with thee. Bless us this day our daily John and forgive us our odies and forgive those odies that trespass against us. Lead us not into Monday and deliver us to lasagna. That was kind of hard. Oh shit. We're hitting a wall damage wise. I need to go get pack three. He's actually just in here beating off. Do you hear him? I need to get like a cushion for my knees or some shit. I'm not a trained veteran like your mom, but I've just been sitting here kneeling and playing. Hold on, I'll be right back. All right. I got a blanket. Oh, round 30. Oh, heavenly Garfield. 
please make this easter egg easy for me when we go to do the last steps oh there's a threshold camo we just need a thousand more crits. All right, two thousand will be done. Holy fuck! And since we got the cash for it, I'm pack a punching our DIE in case we get in a situation where we're out of ammo. Oh, there's a rotten camo. All normal eliminations are done. All right, Garfield, if you're out there, if you're listening, please make these camos go by faster. I still need eight hundred more crits. Amen. Oh no! Please, Garfield. Oh fuck yeah! Shout out my man's Garfield. And he's giving me camos. All right, I got good news and I got bad news. Bad news is I think the suit pops. Good news is I can sit down now. I can barely see fucking anything. The head just keeps sliding down. I'm playing this with fucking glaucoma. This is definitely a fucking Monday moment. Now I understand why Garfield hates these. Oh no! That's some bullshit. This is like playing with a big Garfield blanket over me. But I'm round 40. Garfield, please let me survive this physically. Because it's getting really fucking hot in here and a little hard to breathe. I'll do anything for you. My lasagna king in the sky. I'm out of here. Oh, and let's go! Let's play Diamond Pistols, baby! The power of fucking Garfield compels you. Oh, I can't see shit. But we're almost there. We just gotta whittle down this round a little bit. I think that's probably good. All right, let's go finish this Easter egg, shall we? All right, now what do I do here? Get the fuck off me, zombie. Is it in here? Oh, there we go. This guy's gonna be like, wham, my family, wham. I had to do a Soviet experiment that I didn't want to do. All right, you better speed this up. I'm dying in here. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Fuck off. I will be taking that family picture. And I think that starts us up here. Well, let's hope we can handle this. If you got anything of uh, dying and becoming a zombie in the dark, Aether, you got fucking jacked. Shut up. This is Hell yeah, we will. It will be the first step. I will. The damage I have done. Hell yeah, dude. And it is round 45 now, so my last prayer to Garfield is instead of being like him, I want something in his in his vision. I want something similar to him. I don't want to be him anymore. You cannot be Garfield. Only Garfield can be Garfield. I can't fucking see anything. Oh shit. All right, that's one down. We got two more. Destroy this shit. I think I need to switch to a different field upgrade. Let's use Frenzied. I, I can't get these fucking zombies off of him. My nades aren't doing shit for some reason. What if I use our DIE? That's working a little bit better. All right, they're clear. Fucking start working. Did we get it? Did we get the second one? You guys have to tell me because I actually cannot see. Oh yeah, we're on the last one. Oh! Oh no! Oh, I'm so close to death. In the game and in real life. This is the most intense fucking boss fight I've ever done in my life. Oh shit. Oh, come on. We're down to the last part of it. Come on, finish it. Ah! Well, at least I can get some free damage on these guys while I'm down until I run out of ammo. Oh shit. Oh, I'm so close to death. No! I can't believe this shit. Dying on the very last step of the Easter egg. Oh, and we went down six times. Woo, fuck. But at least we got Plague Diamond, right? But wait, something don't feel right. My Garf Issy. Oh, something's coming out of it. Oh, shit. Uh, uh. Whoa. What? It's the second coming of Garfield. Oh, we've been blessed by the Garfield gods with his only son. Garf. This is what I feel like right now in this suit. Go on, my son. Breathe the air. Isn't he beautiful? Now I'm taking this fucking suit off. Ah! 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 Let's try this Easter strike again. All right, we made it back to the final stage, the boss fight, whatever you want to call it. And I think I'm a few LBs lighter because it's maybe like 80 degrees in my office right here, but it kind of feels cold compared to what it was like in that Garfield suit. I had sweat dripping 
everywhere. But I never want to do that again, and I never will. But this time, we're doing this on round 17, so hopefully it's a lot easier. I even grabbed a death machine. I wish I would have thought of that uh, the first time. We'll go ahead, Orlov. Start destroying this. I didn't even know there was a progress bar in there. I'm not going to lie. I could not see it. So in those eyes, since it's like a blow-up suit, there's like not really like ventilation or it's not like vented. It's not like a little screen over the eyes. It's actually like see-through plastic with the little screen above it. So with how hot it was getting in there, those were getting like all fogged up and it was it was like I was playing in blurry mode. It was awful. I got no excuses this time. We should be able to get through it. That's the first one down. Let's get the second. You know what? Frenzied. We'll do a little bit of that. The zombies still aren't fucking leaving them alone. This is one of the more frustrating like ending steps to a to a Easter egg because this takes forever. A fly will go buzz by his ear and he'll sit there and do this little animation the whole time. All right, but well, we got the second one. Just one more to go. I'm grabbing brain rot for this part. Maybe it'll be useful. We're almost there. Finish it up, pal. There we fucking go, baby. Now let's make like a tree and get the fuck out of here. Come on, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. There we go. Let's see if I remember the path through this. We gotta climb this, go through, up this way, out and around. That was a clutch brain rot right there. I would've got blocked. We've made it. Go ahead and land. Also, this is some bullshit from Raptor 1 because he always acts like he can't land if there's like three little zombies out on the map, but he's gonna land while the whole map is exploding. Whatever, dude. I'm just glad to be done with this. Let me in! Woo! I was about to freak out if I died right there because it wouldn't let me in. Oh, but we did it. All through the power of Garfield. I may not be in the suit anymore, but he's on my heart, baby. And I got his love child right here. The prodigal son. And this is my final stats from that game, in case you're curious. And just in case you're curious, this is what our AMPs look like with Plague Diamond. We got another class done, and these... AMPs don't look too bad, but they did play a lot worse than I remember. I, I remember these being like really good or at least really fun. And I felt like I was struggling with them for a bit, especially once we get those higher rounds. But this is where I'm going to end the weirdest video that I ever made in my life. So uh, if you want to show some support for me going in that fucking fursuit, uh, maybe follow me on Twitter. That would be much appreciated. But for now, uh, thank you guys for watching. I truly appreciate all your love and support, and I'll see you next time. Later to this bitch.